Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Rivals and what I have for you guys today is a tutorial on how to get the upgraded fire bow for the Wrath of the Ancients original bow. Now this is probably one of my favorite bows. Um, it entraps the enemies in like a little uh, pyramid type thing. But uh, yeah, let's get right into it. So uh, the first thing you guys are going to need obviously is the Wrath of the Ancients original bow. And you can just get that by uh, completing all three dragon heads and you'll walk up the steps right there from the pyramid and it'll be sitting there waiting on you. So then the next thing you need to go, do is go to the uh, top of the bell tower and when you get to the top of the tower you see this little symbol on the wall you just want to pull your bow back and shoot it and when you do shoot it this little um, arrow type thing will uh, fly out of it and you just want to pick that up. So then you want to come down to the rocket launch area and as the rocket is getting ready to launch you want to go over and press this switch and then you want to make your way back into the um, uh, little safe zone area where the teleporter is before the doors close obviously otherwise you'll take it down and when you get in here there are going to be a lot of zombies spawning so you want to make sure that you have your bow out and you're ready to shoot because um, I did actually go down in this a couple times trying to do this and they're really dangerous so you just want to have your bow out ready to shoot and um, make sure you can protect yourself a little bit so when you get in here you want to be towards the front that way uh, as soon as the doors open you can make your way out and you're going to shoot this little rock thing on the right side of the screen as I show right here. You want to shoot that little orange type thing and you'll see a meteor or fireball dust come up and it'll actually go above um, right where you pick the um, pack of punch pieces up. And then after you do that step you want to come around the map and you'll see these little figures on the ground. There's one right there by double tap. The next one is right here um, where the jump pad is to go down to the teleporter area. And then as I'm going to show here on the end, the last one is by the Wonder Fizz um, spawn right here. Also the jump or the landing pad, I should say. So then what you guys want to do is you want to come down to each individual jump pad. And basically all you're going to try and do is shoot your bow into the circle that um, the that's on the ground right there. And if you do it correctly, you can see right here that the um, circle will stay lit up and you will actually get an achievement for that. So the next one you want to do is uh, come to this jump pad right here and you'll be hitting the one in the center which is right there and as you can see um, when I get up here the fire or the circle rather is lit up as it should be and you'll know that you did this step correctly. So um, for the last one you want to come down here by the rocket area and um, this one you're going to be working on the one by double tap and you just want to hold your bow and shoot that one as well. Now this one can be a little tricky and I also recommend that whoever's doing the fire bow might want to be the host that way it'll be a little bit easier for you to hit the circles. So then after you get all three circles done you want to bring some zombies around the circles and you're going to have to stand inside the circles and basically just kill zombies and uh, the souls from the zombies will actually come into the um, circle and you'll fill it up. So after you do that for all three circles you want to come up here to the clock tower and hold square on the uh, little gear shift right there and um, you'll get an apothecan symbol that you need to remember or write down and um, there's going to be some fireplaces around the map and inside the fireplaces will be different signs so whenever you uh, go around to the different fireplaces you want to check and see which sign that is in the fireplace co fireplace correlates with the sign that you found in uh, the clock tower and whichever one that is you want to make your way to that fireplace now from here guys you want to go, there will be one certain uh, circle that's lit up and you want to go start from that circle and as your screen's glowing you want to uh, shoot your bow and try and work your way to the fireplace. You only have four shots at this so um, make sure that you're accurate and you're trying to get as far as possible with each shot. Now whenever you um, get to the last shot you want to shoot your bow inside the fireplace and you will see that it lights on fire and then you just want to go up and hold square on it and as you can see the fire will kind of extinguish a little bit. So then you want to make your way back up to where the center circle is and you'll see that this fireball is uh, fell down a little bit and you don't need to shoot a zombie or anything you just need to go up to it and hold square and it will uh, kind of rise into the sky and blow up and then you guys will see that uh, the arrow drops and from here guys you just want to go back down to the uh, where the pyramid is and insert your bow into the uh, or your arrow rather into the box that correlates with your symbol at the beginning of the easter egg. And from here guys you just want to fill your um, uh, arrow up with some souls so just kill some zombies. I recommend using monkey bombs and just throw a monkey bomb right in front of the box and then you'll be able to uh, kill a bunch of zombies and you'll get a bunch of souls. And whenever you fill your arrow up with souls then you want to insert your bow and then obviously it'll work for about 15-20 seconds and then uh, you'll get your bow back and you'll be able to use the fire bow. 
So if you guys did enjoy this tutorial or it helped you in any way, please give a like. And if you're new around here, hit that subscribe button. And I'll catch you guys in my next one.